I know it's officially summer when I start to see fresh picked berries at the farmer's market. The star of the season for me are these beautiful tiny tri-star strawberries. For their size, they pack the most intense strawberry flavor. I always want to bottle up that sweet, bright flavor so I can enjoy a bit of summer any time of the year. My most favorite way to preserve them is by making a shrub. I've made a few shrubs on this channel before, like my mango shrub and my gooseberry shrub for the Caprese-ish cocktail that I'll link below. Uncle Pete's Cocktail Shop recently made a really great classic strawberry shrub that I'll also link below. This strawberry shrub is probably the best one I've made so far, likely because I'm using the best quality of in-season fruit, but also because of the sugar and vinegar choices I've made. I originally developed this shrub years ago for a cocktail called the Zucca Brasi, which I'll post a video on soon. Since it's a cocktail that uses a dark spirit, I macerated the strawberries in Demerara sugar, and I used a malt vinegar that we actually made in-house to acidify the shrub. For this version, I'll be using store-bought malt vinegar, but to jazz it up, I'll be infusing the vinegar with strawberry too. It's almost better to use berries that are almost too ripe when making shrubs. These strawberries are already really juicy, but to get the most syrup, I'm going to roughly dice them. Even though the tops and greens of strawberries are edible, I'm going to remove them so that they don't discolor the syrup while macerating. Since I don't want to waste any part of these delicious strawberries, I'm going to keep them in this jar and use them to infuse the vinegar. For this recipe, I'm using around a pint of Tristar strawberries. Once I've diced up the strawberries, I'm going to cover them in one cup of Demerara sugar. I like to add half the sugar, then stir around the strawberries to coat. Then I'll add the remaining sugar and stir once again. I'll let these macerate for a day or two in the refrigerator. To the jar of strawberry tops, I'll add a half cup of malt vinegar and let it sit out at room temperature to infuse overnight. Once all the sugar has been dissolved, it's time to extract that beautiful strawberry syrup. Even though I'm using dark sugar, the color is a really beautiful deep red. These strawberries produced quite a bit of syrup, just over a cup and a half. You'll want to save those strawberry salads to make strawberry jam or use them for dessert. To the strawberry syrup, I'm going to add the strawberry infused malt vinegar through the same strainer. I'm going to stir to combine and then I'll give it a taste. It smells just like strawberry candy and it tastes like strawberry on steroids. I could drink this on its own, it's so good. The vinegar just really amplifies the strawberry syrup and helps to balance the sweetness. If you find it to be a bit too tart, just let it sit in the fridge for 24 hours and it'll mellow out. It has a really nice color to it and a really rich texture. This would even be good on a dessert or as a salad dressing or even just add it to some club soda on a hot summer day, the way shrubs were actually meant to be drank. Out of all the shrubs I've made, this one is the best. If you have an abundance of strawberries, you have to make this shrub. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll be back soon with another cocktail video. Cheers and have a great week.